Hey guys, this is for reporter Jasmine Zaniga here with Miss Kettle, our new Spanish teacher, and Miss Craig, Miss um, Kettle's student. student teacher. So, um, Miss Craig, what do you want to teach here exactly? I, after I graduate, I want to teach English as a second language. Okay, good. And Miss Kettle, I already said that you teach Spanish, right? Mm hmm. Which one? Spanish one or Spanish two? Spanish one, and we are in charge of an ESL student as well. Okay, great. And what do you want to, what did you do before you came to MHS? Uh, I used to teach at UCA, and then I went to teach at Greenbrier High School, and then I was lucky enough to get a job in my hometown, which is now Moralton. Cool, great. And Miss Craig, or what did you do after MHS or before MHS? Um, I've been studying at UCA up until this semester. Okay, great. Okay, so here's the hard question. Besides becoming a teacher, is there any other thing that you guys wanted to do with your life or possibly something that you've already done? Miss Craig? Um, I love animals and I love being around animals and being outside, so I used to want to be a vet when I was younger. Cool, cool. And you, Miss Kettle? <laughs> I love to dance, and I always thought I could be a good salsa dancer, but my mom thought, no. <laughs> you go to college like everyone else. <laughs> and then uh, I follow my passion of uh, sharing my heritage and my language, which is Spanish, and that's, that's what I uh, find my call. That's great. That's good to hear. What is the best way for a student to grab your attention? I think the best way for students to grab my attention is when they are enthusiastic about the class and they participate a lot, even if it's not their favorite, if they still try to make the best out of the class. Miss Kettle? Oh, I love when students help each other. Like when they see students struggle and they peer tutoring, we have activities, they work, collaborate together when they, when they help a fellow classmate. Uh, we have experienced last, last, I mean, all this time that we have students who actually communicated with students who sp only speak Spanish and that they try to reach out and use their language. That, that, that really touched our hearts. All right, so last question. What is your favorite Spanish word? My favorite Spanish word is conocimiento, which means knowledge. Nice. <laughs> and Ms. Kettle, what is your favorite English word? Schedule. Schedule? I mean, yes, I think it's really neat. <laughs> <laughs> There's no other word that is similar in Spanish. Oh, it's just a fantastic word. I love to use it. <laughs> now we know. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, this has been for reporter Jasmine Zaniga, and back to the dog tracks. Adios.